Hello everybody, Arnick here, and welcome to Sorrow Asylum 3. So remember? We just need to survive. Oh. a bit of time to heal. Okay. I'm gonna see the G the, the doctor. If the doctor is another calendar, I'm gonna be so annoyed. I I absolutely love these like insanity bricks. Like that's how you know you're living in a simulation, when bricks are stacked up like that. That or you have like an S tier. What? What? That or you have like an S tier brick layer. Putting down just enough mortar. And stacking the bricks just right. Sorrow. Sorrow. Okay. Interesting. But what's the sorrow for? <laughs> NSL, I'm sorrowman. Okay, so it's going there. I thought we put. Okay, yep. <gasps> Wait, if an SL, I'm sorrowman, that means. This is my asylum. That is kind of the thing that, like, messes with me. A tiny bit. Like, I know it isn't. I know it's not at all connected. But, when that's your, dis when your display name has that in it, and then you see, uh, and, you know, I tend to shorten it for certain things, abbreviate it. You know, run a company called Sorrow Enterprises and Sorrow Industries, and so I see Sorrow Asylum, and it's like, hmm... Maybe I should build that too in the in, in, in there. Also, bug doctor, scary. I do love how he has like taskmaster vibes with his poster. Let Vanessa go. Okay. I'll let her go. Uh. Hmm, if I do build my own Sorrow Asylum in there, would I get sued for copyright? That's a good question. Maybe if they're distinctly different, it's fine. But if I make it into a walking simulator where you go back and forth grabbing calendar dates and occasionally getting spook scared, then maybe there will be a problem. Maybe. Just maybe. hard to say. I am not a receptionist. No? Okay. Ooh. Nice picture. Not what I meant to hit. That's what I meant to hit. Okay. Only door I can interact with, good to know. This, this is gonna be like FNAF. One of these a year. Have interesting lore. Five nights at the asylum. But, but who's gonna be... I would say who's gonna be his Freddy Fazbear, but... Realistically, it's it's just going to be time war the time war mannequin. I don't know. Do you do, do, does Venus have any other characters that stand out as much as the mannequin? Which I need to totally get another mannequin shirt. <laughs> oh. 
I know you need more time to heal, but this place isn't for that. It's painful. Go back and stay. Okay. Uh, do I just stay in my bed? Or do I go back home? I like just jump out the window, break the asylum. In the darkness. Okay. In the darkness. I'm okay with the darkness. I am the darkness. Do you want cuddles? I want cuddles. But I instill the darkness. Your sorrow. It hurts. Maybe I'm starting to get the pieces of this puzzle. I'm starting to understand. Why are you back here? So now you hear about me. Just go. I don't want you here. Leave. Hmm. Interesting. your sorrow with you. Stay in the darkness. everything together from the previous games to the best of my recollection. It has been a bit since I last played them. And trying to think how much is connected and how much isn't connected. Maybe he had a thing for her, but he wasn't showing it well enough, and she died, and then he's going mad, trying to get her back, or mourning?
but he didn't show his care and his love well enough. Or maybe he didn't realize it. That's entirely viable. He didn't lose his love for me. Maybe that's why I'm here. Tell him that I'm here. Find your doctor and make him remember what he buried. Okay. The doctor killed her? The doctor was in love with her? It was a love triangle. Maybe even more complicated than that. Like a love square. Or a love penta uh, pentagon. A love dodecahedron. Starting to sound more and more like an orgy and less like love. Or I guess just polyamory. I mean, it's, it's allowed. Well, poly is allowed, just the freaking marriage are uh, illegal. Let's not get into that debate. <laughs> okay. But what happened was they all fell madly in love with each other, but something just didn't work out, and so she died. And so... They just, they can't reconcile the fact that one member of their polycule is gone, so everybody's having issues. I'm just glad to see the bricklayer. The bricklayer stuck it through. Sorrow. What is this? Hi, you. Oh. Interesting. Being a model clip. Ah, the disease. It smells so good. I, I want it. You know how. Only I has my disease. I has my disease like I has cheeseburgers. Dream of the death. Follow the death. Okay. Um. Uh, okay. Everything hurts. Your sorrow. It hurts. 
Oh, I'm sorry. I'm just here to keep up my diet of um, calendar pages. No more. That's enough. Polycule for uh, someone who's addicted to eating calendar pages. So I'm good, right? Oh, looks like we're going to 15. Okay. The plague doctor. The plague doctor's gone crazy. The giant mutated head's gone crazy. The dead girl's gone crazy. There 
are jokes I want to make right now that just don't really work without so much context that I could not give them easily. This is possibly one of the only game series that he does that hits me just in a slightly different way, as well as everything else. Oh, I got some... Oh! Okay. So I have the urge to make jokes that only certain people will get. And it doesn't really work for this format. Let's publish a video for everybody to see. And then make referential humor. Niche referential humor, like in jokes with your best friends. Day 12. Oh. I didn't pay. I thought that was like a pill. I didn't realize it was a heart. I can't find him. It's empty here. I thought he would be waiting for me, but it's just empty. So, did the plague doctor fall for the patient, but the patient killed herself? thinking the plague doctor was going to do something to the patient? Or did the plague doctor just absorb the sorrow? <laughs> it's one of those type of doctors that he absorbs the negative emotions. Like, that's, his thing. that's the thing, like, my, my brain is trying to attack this from like 50 different angles to try and figure out what the story is here. End of the day, I probably will never fully get it. If we spell it, it'll, it has to be spelled out to me. When the moon disappears, we're left in the dark. Not even the stars shine that bright anymore. Oh, that is creepy. Who are you? Closer to creepy guy. I think I do. Oh. Now he's gone. This is a bit where these games get me. It's kind of like with Phasmophobia, where like I have that, I, I end up getting this like dread because I have a feeling something's gonna go south. Make it 
in there I need to see him okay I think we're dead chose to suffer through all the pain. Maybe in the end, there is something waiting for you. You are tall. You are one big SOB. I need mean, 14 days of being sick. I better be cured. First time we met, you were free. I remember being free. I want to be free. I want to just live. In my, this song. Get me, uh, just. Yeah, no. Is there a card over there? There's not. Is there one on this? No. Is there a card in here? No. Gotta check everything. Whispers under the night sky. One last moment. See, I remember she. This is the last day for the asylum. I will end the suffering with my own hands. Okay, you're gonna kill me in my sleep tonight. Gotcha. I wasn't here. I was never real. But you still killed me. Dude. I just gotta jump the fence. Nope. The That's familiar. End of my sorrow. The death of my sorrow. Okay. 
think for a Thank you for chilling out and enjoying Sorrow Asylum 3. Um, yeah. Pretty good game. Took about as long as I expected. <laughs> uh, definitely enjoyed. One day, one day, maybe I'll just come out with like a deep lore video to explain half the jokes I want to make. Anyways, thank you all for watching. If you like this, make sure to hit that like button. If you're new here, hit subscribe. As always, you guys have fun. I'll see you later. And, you know, maybe pick the game up yourself. Bye!